What's going on guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we're gonna continue playing Terra on the PS4. And before we start the video, if you guys enjoy the series, please leave a like down below and subscribe. It helps the channel grow. And with that being said, let's start the video. All right, so I forgot what I was doing last time. Looks like we're going back to the workshop. So I checked my mail and unfortunately uh, they didn't give me any, exp any experience scrolls. We're not allowed to cheat on our way to 65. But at least what I can do is queue up for a instance matchmaking. Well, looks like my item level is low. Let me see if I can enchant something and raise the item level so I can queue up. Well, unfortunately, I couldn't enchant everything and my item level is at 258. And for the instance, I need to be at least 302. So it's not gonna work. Well, looks like I'm just gonna queue up for a battleground right now. And continue questing. It looks like my horse doesn't like stairs. Uh oh, wrong way. It was on the other side. Where is this thing? Am I supposed to go here? I think this is it. Yeah, that's him. Dodge. Alright, and you are dead. One more to go. Looks like we need two more players for the battleground to queue up. Let's hope uh, no one leaves before that. And this guy's dead too. Alright, next thing on the shopping list. Gather some fragments. So our queue popped, but the problem is that it's bugged. And it's, it happened like last time. So I won't be able to join right now. Yeah, I can't even enter the battleground, unfortunately. I guess I have to leave. <coughs> but apparently Kumo's Royale is the only thing that people are playing. And it's the one with the giant babies. Alright, so we got the materials. Uh, looks like we're going back to the workshop. Oh, actually the city is right here. Alright, turning in the quest. Wow, it didn't give me any experience. Alright, probably after this quest I'm gonna go back to the main city. And uh, I'll buy some better gear. Just so my uh, item level can increase. And so I can queue up for the instance. And I believe the instance will give me a lot of experience. It's kind of weird how they made this game. From level 1 to 60 is extremely easy and then all of a sudden like leveling becomes extremely hard. Well not hard but it takes a while to level. Well here's the first boss. Looks like a giant... what is that? A uh, weird looking spider I think. Probably a recycled version of the bosses from the other instances. I won't be surprised actually. Well he wasn't so tough. Alright, I believe we use the teleporter here. Well, I was gonna say this dungeon looks pretty small, but never mind. What's wrong with these minions? I can't even hit them. Look! Are they invincible or something? Ah, here's the final boss. The giant crab scorpion. No, oh, dodge that. Alright, he's close to dying. Come on, we got this. And he's down. Phew, nice. Well, he wasn't hard to kill, it just takes a while. Looks like we got some new items. Oh, I mean combat. Alright, turning in the quest, let's see how much experience I'm gonna get from this dungeon. <coughs> Nothing. Oh yeah, I forgot these two instances are connected. I think probably when I get to the level 60 quests, uh, they will start giving me a decent experience. But for now, I need to complete those two. You set off a trap. Okay, so where's the trap? Well, I don't see any traps. So, it looks like I have to pick off each one individually. Well, you can take them all at once if you want to. And they die pretty quick. Alright, and that should be it. The door opens. Let's keep moving. Oh sweet, another cutscene. And he just ate him. Alright, he's getting really close. What?! What happened? How did I die? And here I am, I was thinking that I was gonna do a perfect run to 65 without dying once. Alright, we got a new armor and let's see if it's a reskin or not. Wow, it's not, but it looks ugly. I think I got a new weapon too. What's going on with my gear? I looked really badass and now I look like level 10. Uh, are you guys gonna help me or not? I like how the NPC in this game doesn't give a f about you. Alright, I'm supposed to speak to him, but I can't. My question is why? Hello? What's happening? Why can't I speak with him? No, not you! Do I have to reset my game now? 
Oh my god. Three days later. So I reset the game and looks like I can speak to him now. What? And good news is that I can actually queue up for instance, which I'm going to do right now. Wait, I was supposed to go to Velka, right? Oh no, it's here. Wow, that's a hard quest. Gathering flowers. Wait, is that a horn on a bear? That was easy. Well, it looks like I probably have to uh, split this video into two pieces because currently I have a limited space on my hard drives. Oh yeah, I remember this quest where you have to gather... Well, you guys know what this is. Do you really have to walk this slow? So what's the point of this quest? There's no challenge or anything like that. That was super easy. And now we're getting attacked. I'll probably get to level 61 in this one. And next time I'm gonna try and make a lot of progress. I don't know why I thought that I was gonna get level 65 in like 4-5 or five hours. Sound the horn. Why, why can't you do it? Hey, come here. Oh my god, I'm stuck. Oh nice, we got a dungeon. Let me just kill those monsters really quick. And come on, come on. There we go. Alright. Let's enter. Looks like I'm not the only tank. Oh, we got level 65, level 64s over here. I think this is gonna be a quick run. Alright, looks like we're getting some decent experience from this. Well, we'll see at the end how much we get. Alright, let's see how fast this boss dies. Since we have level 65 in the group. Well, his health is going down pretty fast. Wait, the boss actually takes damage from the spikes? I don't think he does. Yeah, he doesn't. Spikes? Whew, that was close. Nice, we got him. I oh, remember here, we have to destroy the crystals. There we go. And we got him. Alright, so I see a problem here. When you roll for an item, you don't see actually what the item is. You just have an option to roll or pass. And if you're a new player, then... How do you know if, if this thing is for you or not? Oh, I see. Basically, if it's not for you, you can't roll for it. Makes sense. It's so awkward when you fall in this game because when you jump and fall down, you're, you're locked and you can't do anything until you hit the ground. Nice. We got him. Alright, so I'm back and I have to turn in the quest. See, reward and level up. Nice, we got to level 61. I think dungeons is the way to go because as you guys can see I received a lot of experience from it. Alright guys I'm gonna end the video right here. For this episode we reached level 61 but for the next video I'll make a better progress. So thank you so much for watching and I'll see you on the next one. Peace.